Hey everyone, it's Dead. Welcome back to another video. So, uh, a couple things have changed since we've last played. Or should I say played together? Um, I did play for about an hour and a half alone. So, I built this side of the base, which didn't turn out as expected. Um, I did run into the build limit. I will probably change this eventually, because it, it really just didn't turn out the way that I wanted it to. But, my original plan was to have another one of these over here. But I think I'm going to do something a little different. And maybe build a crazy looking tree off the side of this. Um, because I don't think I need any more room. I think it might look cool if I can do some sort of, uh, a lava tower and then a, tr like a more natural formation over there. Um, but yeah, the, the biggest <laughs> time sink was I made, uh, these three pens and I was going to do animal crap. <laughs> And then I was greeted with, uh, oh right, the features are not in the game yet. So, this turned into kind of a, um, a janky little farm that, once all of this grows, I'll start planting in there then, instead of over here. Uh, what else did I do? I think that may have been it. But, as of right now... Um, we're going to go back down into that cave. Oh, I have dogs, too. <laughs> I don't really want them following me, so they just sit out here and bark. Um, <clears throat> but, what we're going to do, first I guess we'll sleep. And we're going to go on the hunt for a couple more diamonds, because right now, I have... Um, just enough diamonds to make a full set of armor. And I already have a diamond pickaxe, which I'm not using right now. I'm going to use these iron axes first. And yeah, I figured it would just be nice to have all of my armor and tools be diamond for once. Which makes me want to ask, do you guys stockpile your diamonds up? Or do you... Uh, use them immediately. I was always curious about that because I am always the guy that stockpiles stuff. Uh, and then, you know, like, I'm sitting here, I only have a diamond uh, sword on me, but I have 24 diamonds in my chest, in my base. Um, so yeah, just let me know. Be curious to know how everyone plays. And I have to figure out what was going on in here, because I have no recollection of this place. Um, I pretty much need everything, a little bit of coal, as much as I don't want it. I probably need some redstone as well. I have quite a bit, but... I really want to make that rail system that goes towards my old base in this world. Which way did I come from? Um, and I know that's going to be consuming. So between the iron that I need and... Oh, speaking of which. The iron and... Uh, redstone because I think that's the best way to power it, which let me know if that is still correct in this version of the game. Some sort of, um, I think the boosting rails are in this version. I think that's the most reliable way. But I'm sure someone will let me know. I have to figure out how to use redstone again. I'm sure it won't be that difficult, but Yeah, we're kind of just uh, resource hogging mode currently. 
It's probably going to be time consuming. Oh, I came from this way. See, I already got turned around. It is also very early. I just woke up. So if I sound like a sleepy boy, that's because I am. Mm. I know there's some paths around here that I did not take in my prior expeditions. <laughs> it's just a loop, man. Oh. Hello? Hmm. This seems new and promising. <laughs> it's not exactly how I wanted to build that. Just wanted to let you guys know. Okay, it sounds like some stuff's really going on below me. Uh, is gold even useful for anything? I don't even remember. Golden apples, maybe? But I don't have any apples. Some iron... Yeah, what is gold even used for? I'm going to I'm going to get that iron, don't worry. <clears throat> but Yeah, I feel like I mean, obviously golden tools are pretty worthless. But <laughs> I feel like it's just an underutilized material. Um, but there might be some special use cases that I don't know of. What level am I at right now? 28. Is this still too high to find diamonds? A lot of lava pouring out from overhead though, which is alarming. I think the chances of me getting lost and just needing to dig straight up, pretty high. Oh, look at this. I actually love that. Actually love it. It's so chaotic. Iron gold. Oh my god, it just, it really just dawned on me how much iron I'm going to need for all these rails. Because it is, I mean, it's not a crazy walk, but it is, it's a hoof. To get back to the old base. I'm not even really sure, like, what my plan is. Once I do that, I just want to be able to travel back and forth. And I guess that's, like, one of the cool things about Minecraft is... You can still have plenty of fun without really having a plan. Because, like, this... So if I don't feel like playing anything, like, this alone is pretty relaxing. Just, uh, you know, random cave, getting resources. It's kind of maybe gearing up 
for whenever you do have inspiration to do something. Or it can spark inspiration. Um, but it's like insane to me whenever people say that they're just bored. And like I'm playing an older version of the game and there's so much to do. I don't know how you could just get bored, especially playing like the new stuff when there's, I guess there's actual objectives in the game now, which I could see how maybe you could get trapped in only doing those objectives when I think they're added there kind of as a progression guidepost or guideline like to nudge you into making certain things but I'm not sure um, but like the fun in this game is just doing whatever you want in my opinion I don't think you should try to beat it per se like that shouldn't be your only objective I'm not going to try and tell you how to play the game but I mean damn All right, <clears throat> this is, uh, this is dangerous. Mm. Could jump down here. I should make a mushroom farm. I really should. I think this seems like a better place to go down. I'm gonna mark this. All right, I kind of want to block this up. Okay, there's nothing over there. I just don't want another incident. I should have, uh... Dang. I did bring buckets with me. So I should... I should get some water. And really just play it safe with the lava. Is that another source? Yeah, it is. <clears throat> Alright. Better safe than sorry. Oh my god. <laughs> Where is this going to take me? Nowhere. Surprise. Okay. I'm going to... Start on the downward path. Don't know why I accidentally hit Q there. Oh, this is convenient. <laughs> All right. Hey, look at that. Okay. Um, I want to be careful. Make sure that I'm not gonna perish. Holy crap. Oh my god. That was very nice. Very nice. There's nothing else around here, is there? Okay. Um, there is... There's a zero chance that I remember how to get back. I'm just throwing that out there. This looks super cool. Lava pool, mushrooms... 
All the redstone. Uh, let's just eliminate the threat. I guess water is an easy way to clear the mushrooms. <laughs> Never dawned on me before. Okay. Oh, I hope I brought enough torches. All right, start gathering this redstone. Oh, relating to mushroom farms. Um, everyone said about a light level lower than something, which I already forget. 12, maybe? Uh, for growing mushrooms. How do you know what the light level is? Like, is that it's not shown on, like, the information screen here, is it? Or do you have to have, like, a mod to show you? I'm going to get the resources. I'm just um, making sure that this area is safe first. All right. Sweet. It's a lot of commotion over that way. Please don't let there be lava under this. Alright, I'm going to pass the coal for now. Redstone, iron, diamonds. For sure the priority right now. And as far as a rail system, for like super long distances, you guys prefer rails that are super high up? Or rails that are like ground level and then you just dig through mountains and stuff to get in your way. I'm thinking that's the one that I'm going to do. Because I just love tunnels. Okay. And let me know, is there a reason for lapis? Is there like a good reason to keep it around? Because I don't think dyes are in the game right now. Oh. Nothing back here. Gold. Yikes. That could have been really bad. The water just carried me right off. Oh, look at this. I feel like I'm going to walk into a trap here. See that redstone. See that iron. Kind of just trying to block myself off a little bit. Hold that for one. All that for one. Come on. Rip. <laughs> Rip. <laughs> as soon as I saw the light level go up, I was like, oh no. It's all over. I don't care about that gold. Oh shoot. How did I miss that iron? I say that like I don't miss a ton of stuff.
Okay. Give iron, please. All right. Um, let's not die. Should I just pour some water on this? Easy. Okay. Make some stairs down. Bump. Uh, actually, you know what? I should have, um, I should make one of these a lava bucket because we are going to have to go to the nether eventually. And I just like to be prepared. Uh, redstone. Okay, actually, while I'm thinking about it, take that off my bar. <laughs> I'm going to do something stupid. <laughs> I can only imagine using the lava instead of the water at one point. Um, this isn't good. Getting kind of low on torches already. And I wanted to be down here for a while. All right. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to start speed running. Jeez! Okay, never mind. We're not going to start speed running. <laughs> oh, every time. Every time. I. Ow. I almost do something really stupid as soon as I want to change my plan. How is that possible? Is that just my bad luck or is that just how Minecraft works? It's like cursed. As soon as I say, okay, I'm going to pick up the pace. And it just says, nah, man. Hold up. Wait a minute. Sit down. Surely I've got to find at least another... Can I get rid of this? Um, surely I've got to be able to find... Diamonds at least one more time. Oh no. Oh no. There. Okay. Diamonds one more time before... I leave this place. Is it worth traversing this? Do we think there's diamonds exposed? Hello? Spooky staircase that I did not build. Never mind. It doesn't go anywhere. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, um, once, I think I'm gonna just gonna start using diamonds for tools and everything. Because I have, I think I have enough now to make a full set of armor and the remaining tools that I need. And unless I have a catastrophe where I die in lava and lose all of them at once, I think I'm gonna be okay. Let's follow the thread. It just runs into a dead end. Never mind. Oh, wow. How did I miss that? <laughs> Wait a second. Wait a second. There's a... T Wait. Hold up. I put that torch there, right? How did I miss this? 
What is wrong with me? What year is it? <laughs> what is happening? Oh my god. Looks like it's just the... A two-piece. It's okay. It's better than a zero-piece, you know what I'm saying? And then I was told... To dig around. Um, because... There can be diamonds, like, up two blocks away or something? Well... Hello? Oh, this is just dangerous. I want this iron, though. But I hear a skeleton, and I don't want to be shot in the back. Oh, I gotta make that record player, too. Hmm. That is something that's on my list. Someone told me the recipe in the comments, too, and I don't remember it. It's a diamond... surrounded in... I mean, it probably makes sense to be surrounded in wood. Oh my god, it takes so long to break redstone. Is this the reason to use a diamond pickaxe? <laughs> this is... It feels like a scam it takes so long. Are we missing an obvious diamond? It doesn't look like it. I should go up there, though. Went down that way, and I came from this way. Hmm. Okay. We will go up here. Oh, I'm like... I'm out of dirt. Hello? Is there nothing up here? Dang. Okay. Mmm... <laughs> Okay, well, clearly I'm lost. Clearly I'm lost. This is going to take a hot second to get out of here. I'm going to do the responsible Let's Player action and say that I'm going to end the episode here. And you're going to have to tune in next time to continue this adventure. Thanks for watching. Peace.